and uh, really, really loved the game of football. Definitely loved the game. Um, sure. You know, it introduced me to fitness in a lot of ways. I, I didn't grow up great at sports or football. Um, my dad was a professional football player, so growing up, oh, wow. I think he was a little sad at first because I think um, I think until I was ten, I was like a video game kid. And then um, when I started middle school, that's when I started playing football. But all these kids have been playing Pop Warner and and little league football and, and sports and whatnot. So when I showed up, I was just goofy. I was uh, slow. I was tiny. And um, I started to see my dad in the summer, and I started working out with my dad. He had, like, some, uh, like, a lap pull-down machine in the backyard. Um, we'd go out to the stairs at Redondo Beach. We'd run the stairs during the summer, take some sandbags with us and stuff. Mm -hmm. And um, basically, I learned that if I set a goal, like, fitness taught me, if I set a goal, I worked hard at it, I started to see results. Right. So I started hitting a little bit harder. All of a sudden I wasn't getting picked on as much. Uh, I started outrunning some of the dudes that I was, uh, that I respected that I thought were the fastest on the team and all those kind of things. And by my sure. sophomore year of high school, I was a heck of a football player, man. Um, I, I never left the field for my sophomore year, junior year, senior year. I played all, all sides of the ball. I was a running back, a slot back, a receiver. I played uh, nice. outside linebacker, nickel back, um, strong safety, cornerback. And then I was a punt return, kickoff return, and uh, your boy could dip, bro. I was I, I was moving back in the day, for sure, for sure. <laughs> yeah, uh, sorry. We won two state championships in high school. Um, that was exciting. We were supposed to win our third. We kind of choked our senior year, but uh, a two-time state champion mm -hmm. for sure. Um, and that got me a couple of looks and some opportunities, man. I definitely had some offers to go to different schools. Um, you know, I talked to Butler. Uh, that was a school that I really wanted to go to in Indiana. I'm from Indiana. So, um, but I wanted to go big time, man. I wanted to play like Purdue or mm -hmm. IU or something like that. And they didn't really even the time of day. So I called my dad. And I was like, hey, man, uh, I think I want to play, Cal I think I want to play ball on the West Coast. Man. Can I come back out to California and uh, check out some schools out there? So during the winter time of my senior year, uh, I yeah. went out to California and my dad and I drove up the coastline in a suit and tie. And I handed my, 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 my highlight reel to all the coaches in all the different programs along the coastline. And I got a lot of calls back and a lot of offers. Um, and I ended up deciding to play at San Diego sure. State. So I played a little bit at San Diego State. That's a long story that I won't go mm -hmm. too into, but they basically might have over-recruited and I kind of got the short end of the straw kind of thing. So I didn't get to finish mm -hmm. out playing ball there, but I played some JC ball. And um, yeah. it was at that time, I guess my mom got kind of sick and I actually started to have to uh, have to work to take care of her. And so that mm -hmm. was where my dream kind of stopped with football. But I, yeah. you know, it's one of those things, man, that, uh, you know, I definitely think I was good enough to go. Everybody thinks yeah. that at least, right? When, they, uh, when mm -hmm. they're playing, they're like, nah, man, I would have made it for sure. If I would have kept playing, you would have watched me on TV right now. But uh, <laughs> football, football was more than – Football was more than the goal that I accomplished or the um, – or, you know, making it to the league or any of those kind of things. It taught me principles. It taught me um, discipline. It taught me about goal setting. It taught me it – it kept me out of drugs and alcohol in high school. Um, in the yeah. Midwest, that's a lot of stuff that kids are into, and there's just nothing to do. Yeah. Kids are getting pregnant and, and doing a bunch of stuff they shouldn't be doing. Um, I was mm -hmm. never tempted by any of that because I just wanted to play football. I mean, that's all I cared about. And so that's yeah. what made it a success for me is that it kept me out of trouble. It got me out of California. It created it created a path and a way and a discipline. And it taught me about fitness, man, and all that stuff. Yeah. So definitely uh, missed the game. But I do think it was a successful go through, dude.